Roswell Flight Test Crew, back here at AUVSI Exponential 2016 in New Orleans. And I'm talking to David Scheffler from Connex. How are you doing today, David? Hi, Patrick. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too, sir. Now, you guys do HD video transmitters, and these are pretty neat. Why don't you tell me about them? Yes. So what we do is full HD, zero latency, robust HD video for UAVs. We can fly with the Connex up to one kilometer, and actually the people in cinematography or inspection can look in real time on the objects that they are seeing. The Connex was announced about a year ago in April at NAB and since then we came with another product which is the Connex Mini. But before that, for many years we are active in the Hollywood world. Okay, so David, how difficult is it to set up one of these systems? It's really a plug-and-fly system. You just plug in the HDMI to the transmitter and the power and HDMI out and the power to the receiver. That's it. No configuration, no software, really plug and fly. That's great. That's great. And then what are the price points for the Connex and the Mini? Okay, so the Connex is a product that's going to for $1,599. It's a complete set of transmitter, receiver and all the cables and the accessories. And for the Connex Mini, it's $1,299. Again, transmitter, receiver, and all the accessories in one box. This is the only system that can do very, very low latency with, with such a high performance. The Connex Mini can do 500 meters or 600 feet with a much smaller size. And so David, how many of these systems can you have working simultaneously in a relatively small area? So we can put four to six system in the same area. Just in this booth right now, you have three system and we have our partner on the other side that it's the fourth system and it's a very noisy environment so four to six is a safe place to be another thing that i would like to mention is that this system is a multicast system so one transmitter can transmit to up to four receivers at the same time so different people can watch the same real-time video now that's very impressive, and you said it's less than one millisecond of latency, so that's good enough for FPV flying. This is very good for FPV flying, and actually Amimon uh, and Connect said that we will come with announcement on May 10th about some products that are coming for the FPV. Some product for FPV racing coming on May 10th. Do you want to give me a hint? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, you I'm can't. sorry. <laughs> Well, so we gave several hints. The product will be uh, consist of a very low latency camera. Uh, there is no low latency camera in the FPV market today, which is HD. And with transmitter and with receiver, it's pretty small size and this will be in the market and the announcement about the details will come on May 10th. May 10th. So everybody out there, stay tuned because it's coming. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, David, so much for your time. Appreciate it. Thank you. All right, and from uh, AUVSI Exponential 2016, this is the Roswell Flight Test Crew signing off.